Saudi Arabia has a huge capacity. Let's talk about cables. Saudi Arabia has a huge capacity to produce cables, much more than what Saudi Arabia needs. And that extra supply is going into the GCC, is going into Africa, is going all around. So there's a huge drive. We have won recent contracts in Iraq, in Nigeria, in Ghana, in, uh, of course, in the GCC. That's, we do that every day. So uh, uh, Saudi Arabia cable manufacturing represents worldwide about maybe uh, three to four percent of the whole worldwide cable manufacturing, which is much more than what Saudi Arabia is, uh, should represent, shall we say. So SIDF, Saudi Industrial Development Fund, is a huge asset that is helping companies like ours and others grow and expand and export to basically start to balance a little bit the uh, oil uh, exports and try to just tweak it a bit into a multi-diversified natural economy, which is what the government wants to have and which is a stable solution and not to be dependent on a single source, knowing that something just dropped 50%. That something just dropped 50%. Uh, so yes, I think we're all aligned into uh, making that happen. The companies, the government, and the funds are all looking at that growth. And Saudi Arabia has a tremendous chance of growing. I think there are some items that Saudi Arabia can compete with China on. Uh, so it has a, it's a great place to, to do something of that nature. The resources are cheap. The, uh, the labor is reasonable. The environment is great. The government help is abundant. So all you need to do is get on with it. Chinese bid against us in cables, let's say, in the government tenders. And they haven't won anything since. Indians bid against us. We are usually 30% cheaper. It's not like 2 or 3%, 30% cheaper than a Chinese bid for cables. Uh, that's one thing. That's our business. That's what we know. If we look at other items uh, in the, our business of electrical, because Bahra Cable is slowly becoming Bahra Electric, we're expanding beyond cables into switchgear, transformers, busways, and so on. We feel we can compete uh, with those numbers, yes. And the result is no Chinese company or Indian company has ever won a serious standard in Saudi Arabia. And there is no protectionism here. It is open for all. Copper is copper, so that has an international value. And that constitutes 65 to 70 percent of the commodity. So whether the copper is made in China or made in Saudi Arabia is going to cost the same. So you play on the 30% that is remaining. PVC is one of it that's produced locally. Uh, labor is reasonable. It's not Chinese, but it's reasonable. Energy is cheaper. And transportation is cheaper to the local areas. So you can, you can compete with Chinese any day, really, in our business.